Be the Math presents Finding Perimeter and Area with Changing Dimensions by a Scale Factor. Perimeter is the distance around a closed shape. All you do is add all the sides together. What is the perimeter of the following shape? We have a rectangle with sides 7 and 11 feet. Notice the far side is 7 feet and the top would be 11 because they match. This gives us a perimeter of 7 plus 7 plus 11 plus 11 which is 36 feet. What is the perimeter of this shape? We have a triangle with side lengths of 10, 8, and 13 inches. Adding them all up, we end up with 31 inches. If you change the dimensions of the shape by the same scale factor, the shortcut is just multiply the perimeter by that scale factor to get the perimeter of the new shape. Look at our rectangle that's 2 by 4. If we have a scale factor of 4, we would end up with a new rectangle of 8 inches by 16 inches. Our perimeter of the first one is 12 inches. Our perimeter of the second one is 48 inches. Notice 12 times 4 is 48 inches. Area is the amount of space contained in a closed object. It's measured in square units or units squared. The area of a rectangle is base times height or length times width. The area of a triangle is the area's one half base times the height. B is the base and H is the height, where L is the length and W is the width of the shape. Find the area of the following shape. We have a rectangle with side lengths of 5 and 9. So the formula is base times height. So we would just multiply 9 times 5 and get 45 inches squared or square inches. Find the area of the following shape. We have a triangle, so our formula is 1 half base times height. So we end up with 1 half times 12 times 4, which would give us an area of 24 square inches or 24 inches squared. So if you're changing dimensions with area and you're using the same scale factor, you would multiply the area by the scale factor squared. The area of a rectangle is 5 inches and the new dimensions is increased by a scale factor of 3. The new area would be 5 times 3 squared, which is the same as 5 times 3 times 3, which is 45 square inches or 45 inches squared. So looking at that, our rectangle has an area of 5 inches squared. Scale factor of 3. So our new shape would be 3 inches by 15 inches. So our area would become 45 inches squared. Note, again, if you do 5 times 3 times 3, you still get 45 inches squared. So in summary, a quick way to remember when you have dimension changes, perimeter multiplies by the scale factor once because it's measured in units. Area multiplies by the scale factor twice because it's measured by units squared. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Email me at bethemath at gmail.com and thanks for watching.